I'm honestly so proud of Arisha and how far she has come as a person and the life she has chosen for herself, especially the man she has chosen to spend her life with. Gordon, it's taken you a while to get that ring on the finger. For a minute, I didn't think you were going to do it. But now that you have, she's yours. There's no take backs. <laughs> There's no exchanges. No, I'm trusting that you will take good care of her, treat her with a lot of respect and treat her nicely. That is not what's in my speech, but <laughs> treat her with all the kindness that she deserves. So, the two of you look at each other lovingly, please. You're now statistically looking at the person who's most likely to marry you. The bride and groom, everyone. <laughs> Good afternoon everyone and a very warm welcome to the beautiful surroundings of Inglewood House and to Arisha and Gordon's special day. Gordon, I join my life with yours today without hesitation. Hes <laughs> hesitation and with an open and trusting heart. I promise to love, encourage and support you and will try to bring laughter, silliness and enthusiasm to our lives. I promise to put us first, always back you up and try not to get upset when you forget something I have told you a hundred times. <laughs> and I will try not to make you socialise to excess. Whatever we may stumble upon in life, I know that everything will be less daunting with you beside me. I am looking forward to seeing what the next chapter of our lives entail. It may not always be easy, but I know with you by my side, we can weather any storm. Gordon, you are my love, my life, and I can't wait to be called your wife. Arisha. Loving what I know of you and trusting what I do not yet know, I look forward to falling in love with you a little more every day. I will support you in all you do and promise to give you confidence when you doubt yourself, help you relax and bring a smile to your face when life is too much. I will do my best to keep up with your hectic social life. I promise to remain a fun and true friend throughout our lives and do my best not to prematurely turn prematurely into a grumpy old man. <laughs> I think it's already too late for that one. <laughs> I promise to be the best husband I can be and look forward to waking up every day with you as my wife. Here is to the next chapter of our lives, however hectic it may be. In the presence of your family, friends and witnesses, I have very much pleasure in declaring you married and now pronouncing you husband and wife. You may share your first kiss. <laughs> Arisha was telling me that Derek had said we hadn't given him enough notice for his speech. And I thought, not enough notice? It's been three years since I asked his permission. <laughs> and all he said then was, she'll be pleased. <laughs> and that actually reminded me of the first time I met Derek. He was outside his house washing his car, as he loves to do. <laughs> and I approached him, very nervous, as I am now and introduced myself with a handshake. He took my hand and said, I have a gun. 
And if you hurt my door, I will shoot you. <laughs> it was at that moment that I knew that I was going to spend the rest of my life with Alicia.